Coldwater Cavaliers volleyball team is your newly crowned Midwest Athletic Conference champions. Leading them is senior Spencer Etzler. For four years, Etzler developed her skills with the help of her head coach and mother, Nikki Etzler. I mean, it's been it's been great. She wants the best for me. It's like a whole family affair. Campbell's in it now. My brother Cole was in it last year, so it's just been really amazing. Well, I'm so proud of her, and I'm, I'm proud of her for the way she handles herself and the teammate that she is, and that her skill level has been able to develop through that, and that I'm, I'm super proud that she has great teammates that help her be the person that she is. So it's like I'm proud of her because she's not only my daughter, but be a, because she's a part of this team with this really special group of girls. It's a dynamic that carries plenty of change, yet reaps so much reward. The girls, both Spencer and Campbell, have talked about when we leave the gym, can you just be my mom? And so at home we're just mom, and then when they ask us to be a coach, either Mike or myself, then we say, okay, we're going to put on the coach's hat, and we're, we're going to talk to you like a coach. So I feel like we have found that balance this year. Work hard, do, your, do it yourself, like don't worry about others, just keep going forward, eyes on the prize. The senior standout's talent does not go unnoticed, recently earning her second straight MAC Player of the Year honor while also being named an All-American, an athletic resume that allows her to attend Stanford to start her college career. Probably the first time I went to camp there, I was like a freshman and I would, like right when I walked on campus I was like that's like where I want to be. Obviously academics and athletics are like the highest of the standard there, so I just think that and the coaching staff and the girls were amazing. I'm really excited for her and the opportunity at Stanford, but I'm not naive to know that, uh, you know, it's going to be difficult and it's going to be challenging. I think that she's ready for that, and I think that her path to this point in, in her career has prepared her for it. One final accolade has evaded Etzler, state champion, and she knows what it takes to get it. I mean, I think this year we've been working hard day in and day out, and we just have like a really good team chemistry together. So I'd say just continue to do what we're doing and get better every day. In Coldwater, Jack McGuire, WOSN.